the narcissist would rather see you fail than succeed. When the narcissist discards you, they would rather see you being unsuccessful. They would rather see you unhappy and uncomfortable than to see you achieving something that you have been aiming for. Than to see you having your desired result. They would rather see you living on the streets with no money, with no one there for you, than to see you in a multi-million dollar home, driving the car of your dreams. They don't want to see you living a good life, because that would only make them regret the decision of leaving you. That would only make them feel like they made the wrong decision. And that is something they cannot deal with. They cannot deal with a thought or idea that they dismissed you as insufficient, worthless and a failure. They saw you as a gullible and easily deceived person. Someone who is easy to fool and trick. And then a few months later, you come back. You're bigger and better than ever before. You have more money than ever before. You're more successful than ever before. You're dating people who are more attractive and more successful than the narcissist that you were with. That is something they cannot deal with. They're not going to be happy for you. They're going to hate you. They're going to be wondering why you were never like this when they were around you. they're not going to self-reflect and come to the conclusion that they were never supportive of you. They never provided encouragement or emotional support. They never believed in you. They were too preoccupied with looking for someone with more desirable qualities. They were too preoccupied, thinking the grass was greener on the other side. They didn't care about you. They didn't care that you invested years of your life with them. They didn't care that you tried to make them happy. It was never enough. They were very ungrateful and unappreciative. All they did was drain your charisma and self-esteem by taking subtle digs at you. All they did was throw temper tantrums. They focused on your faults and mistakes. They magnified your flaws and imperfections. They were never accommodating. They were never willing to fit in with your wishes or needs. They were never cooperative. They were never helpful. They were constantly dragging you down with personal attacks. And that is why you didn't succeed while you were with them. They didn't support you. They were never a source of strength or comfort for you. And now you've moved on and you're successful. And if you haven't already, you're going to find someone who is far better than that. Someone who is going to partake 
in everything that you have achieved. All of the special and nice things that you will enjoy. Things that they could have partaken in, but they didn't. They made that decision to leave you. They discarded you like you were nothing. And you're not the first person they've done this to. They've let go of a lot of people they should have held on to. And it's only going to come back to inflict punishment and misfortune upon them for their poor judgement and misdeeds. Because they were once with you. And you wanted to be with them. But they discarded you. They let you go. And then you moved on to become successful without them. And now they have to accept and tolerate their unfortunate circumstances. Narcissists don't live for the future. They live in the moment. They didn't believe in you. They didn't have trust or faith in you. They expected you to fail. And many of you may still be in a narcissistic relationship right now. where the narcissist is about to discard you. They're ready to get rid of you. And there's nothing you can do to save the relationship. In their minds, you can't do anything right. It's like they deliberately destroy everything you try to build. The harder you try, the harder they make it for you. You can try to take their wishes and needs into consideration, but it will never be enough. They will never be satisfied with anything you do for them. Because they're not satisfied with themselves. They have low self-worth and low self-esteem. And they expect you to complete them by fulfilling their wishes and needs. But it's never going to be enough for them. Because the root cause of the problem is that they feel like they're not enough. Which is another reason why they don't want to see you being successful. They don't want to see you replacing them with someone better. Someone who has a higher quality of character and a higher level of ability. They would rather see you on the streets. They would rather dismiss you as insignificant. They would rather ride off into the sunset with the thought of you not doing anything with your life so that they feel like they made the right decision by discarding you. So that they don't have to regret the decision to leave you. The last thing they want to see is you reviving yourself, being renewed after their destruction and proving them wrong. It's not easy to go from being at the brink of death to being successful. 
to go from the bottom to the top. To turn your life around after everything they did to you. And in such a short period of time. That is not an easy thing to do. But don't expect the narcissist to congratulate you. Don't expect them to acknowledge your success. Because they never wanted to see you succeed. They never wanted to see you shine. They wanted everyone else to shine at your expense. And when they discard you, they want to see you fail. They want to see you being unsuccessful in achieving your goals and dreams. They want your life to deteriorate after they have left you. It makes them feel better about their own lives. But when they realize that you've moved on and have become successful without them, they're still not going to entertain the thought or idea that they made the wrong decision. They will minimize your success. They will discredit you. Because deep down they know they screwed up. They cannot be happy for you. Because they're not happy with their own lives. But no matter what they say. No matter how they try to minimize your success or discredit you. I can assure you. That if you have become successful after they discarded you. They do regret the decision. In fact, they think it's the biggest mistake they ever made in their entire lives. It's like they had the winning lottery ticket. They could have won the jackpot but they just threw it in the trash. And that is really the ultimate revenge after everything they did to you. After they wanted to see you fail. After they wanted to see you on the streets with no one. After everything they put you through. You have the right to live your best life. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.